Hey, what's up, guys? And today we will be, we'll be doing another update video on Pokemon Sun and Pokemon Moon. And in this video, uh, all I'm gonna do is, see, and you know, I'm gonna I'm gonna be, you know, talking about all the the, the new stuff that's been released today on July. I mean, I mean, I think it was like August first. I don't know. Okay, and I'm going back to school in like nine days. Hmm. But yeah, so on and well. When we when the school year starts, I I, I won't be able to upload videos as as much. So yeah, so don't uh, unsubscribe on my channel if if I don't upload it as much. Okay, okay. So yeah, and if you remember in the last video, I talked about Pokemon and the Cyanary stones, but whether that's not the case, that they're they're not got Cyanary stones. And yeah, I'm I'm just gonna talk about that stuff after I show you guys this video that I found. On the website, okay. Which I think it looks so awesome. Okay. And and this is something different. Holy smokes! In a logo for you. That's adorable.
Yeah, you've already seen this, but I just think it's awesome every time I see it. And yeah, that that little the little part of our um gun shoes was just adorable. And yeah, th th that was just adorable right there. And now I have to go back to it. And and, and you guys saw a little, like the like the little forms of a few Pokemon, which I just thought was very awesome. And you can find Pokemon. And I'm guessing that, that these people that were shown are like gym leaders. I don't know. And yeah. And at the end of the video, I'm going to explain what these are doing in the circle. But let's check out the Pokemon. And let's check out some more. Let's, let's go with some like, more about it. Okay. So, I can be honest. I, I think that Alone Vulpix is just adorable. And the Alone Nine Tails is majestic, I guess. Alone Executor. I think it's pretty, maybe a little freaky, I guess. It looks a little freaky, if you ask me. A little in sand shoe, a little in sand slash. It's just awesome. Oh, yeah. And now let's get to the actual Pokemon himself. And, yeah. So, so, so here they are. We're just click on this one. And we're just going to keep going. We're just going to go through them all, okay? So, here's Foreman. Foreman test. Okay, okay. That's really cool, and here's the evolution line down here. Yeah, which I think is awesome, but I, I want to really want that on my team. And yeah, oh, blooms the bloom sickle Pokemon. This sounds kind of violent. Okay, and then and now let's go to the next one. Um, gum shoes. That's awesome. I think it should be a a, a normal and ground type because it. Cause, Cause it looks like a normal ground type to me. And yeah. And let me see. Let's see. Well, what does that remind me of? I can't remember what it looks like. It looks like... Um, what does it look like again? Um, what's that man with that hairdo? If you guys if you guys can remember, because I can't remember. Well, I'll try to remember, but... Okay, here's my, my miner with the shields and without the shields. If I got one, I would love to have a blue one, not a pinky one. Oh, and here, here's all of them. I would, I would love to have a blue one. I see in at the bottom corner, the right. Okay, and here's Mudbray, which evolves into you guys are probably already know that thing. That I can't remember what's called, but I think I th well, I bet that's. I, I I bet that Ash, you 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 know Pokemon. I bet Ash is gonna have a have a Mudbray on his team, cause cause, cause it looks su su suitable for him if you ask me. And here's a Aura Coro ballet style. Okay, ballet. It looks like he's doing more like the something. And here's the Aracura pom pom style. And I'm just, I'm not gonna say the name. I'm just gonna say the style. And here's the Paolo style. That looks all relaxed. And here's the, the Sensu style. Pretty cool. I the, there's so many cool ideas that came up. And here's a a a, a sand shoe. To me, it almost looks like an iceberg or something. Or oh yeah, not like like an ice. What are they called again? Like the Ice globe. I can't remember the card, but here we go. Here's a lone sun slash the mouse. Are you kidding me? The mouse Pokemon. That's the same thing as Pikachu, and Pikachu should be called Electric Mouse Pokemon. What does, what does this thing, re? How does this really resemble a mouse in any way? It makes no sense. That's a cool, like, 
Freaka, come on, Game Freak. I've not seen what the name is called, but come on, Raiders. I know you, you can do better than that. And there's a lone Vulpix, which is adorable. I love to have it on my team. Here's Lone Mon Nine Tails. And yeah, I think this should be it. Oh yeah, and there's a a Lowland Executor, a Grass and Dragon. So they changed it from a Grass and Psychic. I think, yeah, I, it kind of makes sense, cause oh yeah, the, there there's also a, a Kogadon's tail. I'm guessing they can offer it to other people or Pokemon if they need something to drink or eat. Oh yeah, and then there's this thing that the only Pokemon so far that, that that can poison Steel types. Cool. And yeah. Now let's actually go to the, um, let me see. Oh, yeah, the cool features. Yeah. So, so I can show you guys what I mean by those stones. So, this, so you know what the Z-moves are so far? And this is not it, it, it. Oh, yeah. And let me see if I can find it. Let me see. I know. I think if I click here, it should show me. Let's see. Oh yeah. Okay. So 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 the so the so I thought there were signer stones, but they're actually called Z crystal. So I guess so I guess the the, the color of a so I guess you can have more like more multiple Z crystals and yeah. I'm guessing that and there's also a Z ring. I wonder what I call a ring instead of like wristband or something. I don't know. And yeah. Let's see, what does it say here? There are two conditions for performing C moves. A Pokemon must learn a move of the same type as as a Z crystal, and it must be holding the corresponding Z crystal. Oh yeah, like like Mega Evolution. Here's right here, experience the, the Z ring for real on your own arm. When a player uses a Z move in, in Pokemon Sun and Pokemon Moon, his or her real life Z ring will light up, vibrate, and play sounds to go along with the video and sounds in the game. With the new experience, players will feel the force over, 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 overwhelming Z moves e with even more realism. And please, please look forward to more details about Z ring to come from Tommy International. Hmm, that's pretty cool. And yeah, I think I'm about to wrap up this video, and I'll see you guys later. Bye!